Hi everyone, I'm here to take you through the animation for Presbyterian High School um, animation mouse and cat um, scratch project. So let's do it. Go to the online scratch software, log in to your account first, then press create and after that load the file from your computer load the one that is animation okay so you see this yellow color background now you need to do this you need to add a mouse a cat a cheese as objects so what are the other costumes the cat will have a second costume which is cat 2 the mouse will have a second costume which is mouse 2 these are not sprites these are costumes okay so let's do this go to the sprite area and upload upload the cat you can press Control key on your keyboard to hold down in order to select more files okay so cheese and mouse open and you have these three things okay for the for the cat there's a second costume so go to cat first go to costumes and over at costume look at for the button to upload a new costume which is cat 2 and press open should have a different costume for the cat okay so that it looks like it's running next for the mouse the mouse also have a second costume under costumes go to the button nearest it and upload a costume which is mouse 2 okay so when it comes to the cheese there's no second costume but we need to go to costumes of the original cheese and remove the white color background okay it should be transparent so in order to get a transparent background follow these steps choose solid color okay click once choose no background click this red color line one time and click outside choose fill bucket and go to the white background and click one time okay so you may replay this part of the video to watch how i remove the background again okay so now you can pause the video and do the steps that i just shared with you when you are ready come back to this video and we will continue to scratch the other codes Okay, welcome back. So we are now at question number four. Save your animation as animation underscore your name. And can you also put PHS because this is their question. Okay, so you can press file save now. Okay, question number five says that we are going to create an animation which shows a mouse moving towards the cheese first and then eating it. Then the cat will appear and move towards the mouse to catch it. Okay, so what are the instructions? The instructions are at the next page. When the animation starts, this means it's the green flag. Okay. And the cat will be hidden at the beginning, so this is high. Wait for the mouse to touch the cheese, then appear at location. Okay, so we have to wait first. When the mouse touch the cheese, then appear at this location. So this is go to. Okay, repeatedly, we are going to use a repeat function, a repeat loop okay and to move towards the mouse so this one has to 
move towards the mouse, maybe move 10 steps. If it's too slow, we can increase. Then we must remember to change costume at an interval of okay, 0 0.1 second until it touches the mouse. Okay, so change costume is next costume. And interval 0 0.1 second is your weight. Okay, so we are going to use the function which is uh, repeat until it touches. Okay, repeat until. So we are going to use the repeat until coding block. Okay, so once it touches the mouse, we are to say, the cat is to say play meow. So play meow sound. And display the text. So display text can just use the cat to say delicious for two seconds. Okay, and hide again. Okay, so we are going to code for the cat first. So here we go. Green flag, then hide. So go back to the cat, go back to code, go to events. When the green flag is click, okay, we must ask it to hide first. So under looks hide. Okay, so next is wait for the mouse to touch the cheese. We know there's a waiting time here, but we are not sure how much time. So we're just going to put a number to it. Then appear at location negative 190, negative 120. So I'm going to code. So now waiting time not sure how long okay let's just put a uh, two seconds we can change it later okay so we are going to use the go to under motion go to negative 190 and negative 20 okay oh sorry negative 120 okay Next, repeatedly. So we are going to use repeat until touching the mouse. So repeat until. So repeat is under control. Let's look for the word repeat until. This is the one. Until touching mouse as under sensing. Touching mouse. Mouse. Okay, to put this in, we must click and drag until the this uh, hexagon lights up in white. Okay, and then we let go of the mouse. Okay, so repeat until touching mouse. What to repeat? Move 10 steps, next costume, and wait 0 0.1 second. Okay, so move 10 steps is motion. Move 10 steps, 0 0.1 seconds. Next costume, sorry. Let's follow the order. Moving, change costume, and 0 0.1 second. Moving, change costume, which is look, next costume, and 0 0.1 seconds. Okay. After which, play the male sound. So this is not part of the repeat until loop. Okay, play male sound must be outside the repeat until. Okay, so does it have the male sound? Let's see for the cat. There's no meow sound, we have to upload. It's the sound given to us. No, it's not given. Let's look for the sound. Okay, so choose the first one. Okay, and we play to see whether there's a sound. So it works. So now the code, we must ask the, give a code so that it will play the meow sound. So we put this code play meow sound until done. And what happens next in the questions is say delicious for two seconds and hide again. So say is under looks. For two seconds and hide again. 
So under looks again, hide. So the script for the cat will look like this. However, for the wait two seconds, we may change to a bigger number if we feel that the mouse has not eaten the cheese. Okay, so let's play it. Okay, nothing. The cat does not show. Because when you go to this location, it should show because you ask it to hide. So there must be something to balance it. We have a hiding, we must also be showing. So go to looks, we are going to repair. There's a bug here. Okay, the bug is over here. We must show after going to this location. Okay, okay there you go. Okay, so in red color font, I'm going to write down where's the bug. Here is the one. We must put show when it goes to this location. Okay, so now pause the video and go and code as what was being taught just now. Okay, when you're ready, come back to this video. Okay, welcome back. Okay, so now we are going to code for the mouse. Okay, so for the mouse, I will be going through the instructions first. The mouse is to appear at location 95105. And since we learned just now that when you appear, it must also come with show. Point in down direction. So this is point in direction. Waiting for one second repeatedly until Okay, we are going to use the repeat until loop again. Move, so we are going to use move 10 steps. Okay, and change costume is next costume. At an interval of 0 0.1 seconds. Okay, so this is another waiting time. Okay, so we're going to display text yummy for 2 seconds. So this text yummy is by the mouse. The mouse will say it for 2 seconds. And wait for cat. This waiting, I'm not sure how many seconds, but we can put the wait code first. The mouse to touch the touch it and then hide again. Okay. Okay, let's proceed to code for the mouse now. Okay, so for the mouse, we need to first go to the mouse. Okay, click on the sprite mouse. And now we shall go through the instructions. The instruction says when the animation starts, okay, so you need a green flag again. Go to events when the green flag is clicked. Okay, so the mouse will appear. So appear is show at this location. Go to 95 and x is x is 95 y is 105 okay and must be pointing in direction 180 which is down okay then wait for one second under control repeatedly until is what we want to use repeat until it touches the cheese so sensing is to sense whether it touched the cheese drag it until hexagon lights up in white okay let go and whether the mouse is touching cheese if it touches cheese then you do the next thing which is to display text yummy okay so looks say yummy for two seconds and wait for cat to touch the mouse then hide okay so wait i'm not sure how long you wait maybe two seconds okay and for the cat to touch the mouse then hide okay so hide is under looks 
So if you discover there's a mistake here, we have not asked the mouse to repeat something before it touched the cheese. So we need to go and read again. Repeatedly move towards the cheese. So moving is motion. Change costume is next costume. And at the interval of is waiting time. 0 0.1 seconds. So the mouse must keep moving, changing costume, and wait between two costumes to wait 0 0.1 seconds before changing to the next costume. Okay, but if when it touches the cheese, it will get out of this loop and it will just go to say yummy for two seconds. Okay, so again, once it touches the cheese, it will say yummy, wait for a certain number, amount of time and hide away. Okay, let's play this. You, if you want to play, you can click the green flag here. If you want to check this script, you can double click this script. Okay. Okay, the mouse is not moving. And why is that so? It's because the cheese is too big. It has already touched the cheese at the beginning. So there's no need to move. See? Repeat until touch cheese. If it touches the cheese, just say yummy. No wonder our cheese, our mouse, say yummy immediately because it's already touching the cheese. Okay, so now what we have to do to the cheese, perhaps to move it aside, then see whether it moves. Yes, it's actually moving. You can't find the cheese now. But you can see its tail is moving, right? But the cat can find the mouse. Okay, so now we have to go to the cheese and continue our coding. There's just two codes here, a few codes here. So for the cheese, we must make it appear. Appear is show. Show at this location, x is 90 and the y is negative 140. Okay, and I realize that there's no code to resize the cheese so it's good to put a code down set size to a certain percentage a small percentage so that the cheese is so much smaller than the original size okay let's decide on this number soon okay then after that you wait for the cat to touch the cheese so there's a waiting time touch the mouse okay so wait for cat to touch the mouse then hide away okay so Together with the mouse, it will hide. Okay, let's do this now. Go to the cheese. Go to green flag. Because animation always starts when the green flag is clicked. Okay, so what must the cheese do when the green flag is clicked? Should the cheese disappear? No, it should appear instead. Show at a certain location so go to 90 for x and negative 140 for y then remember we said the size is too big so under loops set size to perhaps 10 percent and let's double click this to see what happens to the cheese if the cheese is just too small now you may want to resize to let's say 30 Double click. Okay, if this is all, all right with you, then just leave it. Okay, so. Okay, so now we have not put in two more codes. Wait for the, wait for the cat to touch the mouse. I give it one second, then hide looks high so let's play the entire animation okay there's something wrong with it you discover that the that the cheese hide too soon so let's put three seconds still too fast i put four seconds
Okay, so this is how our animation should be. I'm not going to change the other timings. I will just continue to leave it as the, as it is. So once you're done, go to File, Save Now. And share the project in the correct studio. Thank you everyone for watching.